kind of fucking terrifying. Yeah. Okay, so let me turn the microphone up a little bit. Let me turn these down. There we go. Hello, hello. Can anyone hear us? Can everyone get hear up. us? Get, get, get down. Xbox and PlayStation coming to town. Yeah, there we go. Unboxing. That's right. We got Tom Mike Tossing. Yeah, yeah. We're unboxing and uh, we're doing a little. Uh, oh crap! <laughs> it moved on us a little bit. Let me get that fixed. Yeah, we'll move it to the center of the table whenever we do the uh, main part of it. But giggity giggity, yeah. Gig giggity goo. But yeah, there we go. <laughs> Needless to say, I'm very excited. I'm very happy that I'm finally able to unbox these. Because here's the thing. I've had these for a while, guys. I've had these for a long, long while. Long time. And I've been waiting very patiently to open these. Mostly my bad. Sorry, It's, it's okay. It's okay. Hey. It's, <laughs> that's just how it goes. I'm not complaining. I'm not saying anything. It's just you life, every, guys. You have every right to complain. Happy so. late birthday. I had to work last night. That's perfectly fine, Logan. Hey, I'm just glad that you're able to be here and you're able to participate in this with us. Yeah. So it's actually uh, supposed to be an unboxing, but we're going to turn it into a spanking. Are you ready? Uh, all right, go ahead. Public. Ah! Ah! Wait. Got you. We got a... Hello? Oh, hey. It's Sir Nikolai. Sir Nikolai. There he is. Don't die. Oh, yeah? Okay. Yes. Okay. Team Xbox over here. No, he's not. No. Yes, he is for today. For uh, you already signed up. You just said I'm here for the Xbox. I, I said it was I'm here on the to see what it looks like in person because I've never seen one before. Okay. How, all right. How big it is. Well, well we're going to, we're going to, okay. What yeah. we're going to do <laughs> we're gonna is it, we have, we have the PlayStation, okay, so I got the PlayStation 5 first and then I got the Xbox second. So what we're going to do is... Open this one first, and then I know what Chad's going to say. Save the best for last. I wasn't going to say anything, but you're right. Damn it. Thank okay. you for that. Okay. So, <laughs> Superman of a Claw. feedback on that thing? <laughs> Look, man. Y'all can I don't have the so. $500 words. So, I'll, I'll take... Surround sound controller vibration. The most least innovative <laughs> controller in the fucking console wars right now, by God. Old trusty. But it, it's pretty much... Who like, ever owned an Xbox and didn't have to replace the controller multiple times? That's what I really want to know. I'm not even going to try to fight that battle. because I didn't have to replace my controller, but I had to replace my Xbox. So, yeah. on top I of the... On top, so, too. we actually have more accessories for the PlayStation 5 than we do the Xbox Series X. Because the Series X... It honestly, I'm just. To me, the biggest problem is it still uses batteries. So we got us a oh, recharge. Yes. So we got us a recharging we're station. Live. The official one. I thought you were recording this. Oh yeah, we're <laughs> live. We're live. <laughs> yeah, we're live. Of course we're live, dude. You see the chat? Yeah. They're freaking out. It's a good thing I realized <clears> that before I said something. You want to have <laughs> <it out>. Oh gosh. <laughs> we're no editing here. No editing. This is all all live and. Uh, all good. A, so uh, we time have machine. here we have uh, two PlayStation Five controllers as well. Uh, got these. Nick also got a set of these for his PlayStation Five down here. It's so It'd nice. be kind of a yeah. spoiler if I showed them off, wouldn't it? Yeah, it would be. But we can see them, but y'all can't. <laughs> it's so nice. And then of course right next to the, the mystery box, which I will save for here in just a little bit. But y'all will it's be inflatable on your back. Shut up, dude! God, damn it, spoilers. Spoilers, there Sorry. you go. It's ruined. The evening's ruined. We're ending the stream. That's it. Goodbye, everyone. Just joking. No, I'm not doing that. <laughs> uh, so, what we're going to do, going to start out, going to crack open this PlayStation 5. Let's actually see what the overhead view looks like. Yeah. Oh, God. Yeah, Let's there it is. That other angle. There it is. Yeah. Let's get back here. There we go. So, I'm going to... Get this out of here. Oh. Yeah. Let me set this to the side. Okay. Sir, Go I'll ahead. Thank you. Thank you. Well, I'm unboxing this. You're unboxing this. No, I, I'm saying, like, at least I'm not in there getting solid in half. <laughs> this is fine with me. Okay. So here we go. We are now getting into the main box. Let's see. Yep, there it goes. Okay. So, all right. In here we have the controller, which... Look at that son of a bitch. Mm-hmm. 
Look at it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Look at that. Mm-hmm. So you can see it's the solid white edition. You know, or like as it, you know, it ships with all of them. Yeah. Chad, if you want to handle that real quick. You got the power cable, of course. This thing is sharper than a straight shooting storm filter. Which is, thing. which is never. <laughs> if we're being the honest. Unicorn. The unicorn storm trooper. Yeah. Ah, and of course. By the way, for those of you who have not yet got your hands on a PlayStation 5, Haptic feedback, if you have not had it explained to you, is essentially surround sound vibration. It is fucking legit. It is. Yeah, I will crazy. admit, the stuff I've played of it and stuff, you've tried it out, haven't you, Chad? Yeah, it's really neat. It's because really, I heard really the cool. word when I were putting the console out. I was like, what is that? I don't even know what that means. Who cares about so, that? So, okay. About that. And then when you feel of this controller vibrating in places that it would be vibrating on the screen, on the controller specifically, you're just like, oh my god. So, yeah. in that's terms of level. so in terms of the stuff that is in the uh, the top box, which usually has like uh, controller cables and stuff like that, you have the high speed HDMI 2.1 cable. Glad it ships with that. And then uh, you have yeah, the power cable. Clank has a really really good haptic feedback part. Early yeah, on. I showed it tonight. And then the uh, power cable for the controller and then this little monstrosity is the stand <laughs> now uh, here's the thing it can be used either see so you can either take i think this little plate off here mm -hmm. and this might uh, mainly use to stand it up like this or you put it sideways and set it on top and this is if ah, you put okay. it like this it's for standing it up okay because that'll pop down and it sits right here and oh, okay okay the, the hook's there and then if you turn it this way. Yeah, put a little closer, Nick. Okay, so, so... That way it conforms to the bottom, like, flow of the curviness of the system. So you clip this onto the... So, yeah. And then it'll sit sideways. Like this, this was sort of, to me, like a little bit of a, a thing, extra thing they added in at the last minute. Looks like the Enterprise. Built like the USS do, Enterprise. Do, <laughs> do, 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 do. Yes. Enterprise. <laughs> It would look even more like it if they would have made it white. Like, yeah, oh, dude, yeah. But the only thing that sucks about the stand is it does not really come on very tight. Oh, so yeah, that's, that's... If you're not careful when you move your console, it will just pop right off the stand. And be that, careful. You that's, the, that could you cause gotta, some, like, basically some drama. Touch your some drama on the stand to hold it on if you want to slide the console around because the thing's heavy. Okay, so... They always are, right? The first ones that come out in every generation are like... Safe for yeah. Nintendo, as we safe, discussed. Yeah, that. safe for Nintendo. Nintendo does everything small. Yeah. Uh, ex well, sent except the Nintendo well, actually, 64. Actually, they are small when they get larger with their handhelds. 64. So they give you a tiny handheld, and then they'll like end up the last one they put out will be like handheld but with a fucking big screen on it. Oh uh, yeah. yeah. They go out. Yeah, they go opposites with their different variations. Yeah. So yeah, they do. here we go. We have here the main meat of the system. Meat, 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 meat. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's just sexy. Look at that. Yes. Look yes. at that, baby. Look at that. Kind of looks like the mouth of Sauron's head. Kind of. Kind <clears throat> of. <clears throat> but. By the way, for everybody that I've heard talk of shit about, there's nothing to play on PlayStation 5 so far. Oh, so yeah. You got Nate's game. So he's Which, be here, I got. Actually, I got three that you don't have, but yeah. there you go. So we got Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Oh, there we go. We have Godfall, which I'm unsure of right now. And then we have Mortal Kombat 11 Ultimate. And then you have the more exclusives. Spider-Man Miles Morales. Returnal. Ratchet and Clank. Rift Apart. Judgment. Which is not exclusive. No, but it's but still it's, it's still, still awesome. fucking nice on PlayStation And then 5. Demon Souls, yes. which, yeah. So that's the piece they literally just at the moment. <laughs> Hell yeah. So... Uh, there you go, Nick. Those are yours. Save for the Miles Morales. Oh, yeah. And then Integrate, because I had that there. I have my version there, although Nick got the extremely, Here's like, my, uh, awesome Steelbook, Steelbook. edition. Ooh, a little bit further nice. back here. It's hard to right load here. up on the camera. Right there. So, did they give you the regular box with it, too? Yes. yes. See, yeah. <laughs> what the f they, they The Steelbook <laughs> was crazy. just, like, an extra thing they sent, like, right. separately. So I actually that just, makes no sense to me. Yeah, it was I, in a different package. I like all my boxes to match, so, so I just have this standing here as decoration. I don't even know what to do with the one that I've got. Just it's, setting it next to the system like that. So, so here we go. Let's see. Ah, okay. So as you can see here, yeah. So the little hooks line up in here, like so. Ooh, it's got a 
bunch of room to vent. Mm-hmm. And yeah, Thank it's God. just it's just an absolute monster in terms of its overall scale. I mean, look at this thing. But yep. So I'm sitting that side over here for now. Hella hardware. Mm -hmm. I mean, if you're an Oddworld fan, Oddworld Soulstorm is available digitally <laughs> for PlayStation 5 as well. And there's also Sackboy Adventures. Oh yeah, that's right. And Astro's Playroom comes digitally as well, and it's very fun. It's a love letter to the previous PlayStation generation. Yes. And I really want to play that. I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, it's very cool. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh, Dude, I wonder what a skate game is going to feel like with that haptic feedback. Ooh. Dude. Were, you hear that, EA? They were talking about it recently. You but, hear that, uh, EA? Skateboarding games tend to pop up every once in a while. We're due for a good one. Yeah. Here we go. There's so. A chance for a port to only one two, three, you know, that's, uh, that would be crazy. Already. There it is. What the fuck? Is that the charger? That's the stand for the, or it's the charger for controllers. You basically just get it here. Oh, damn. It ain't got any legs or anything. It's just, that's... That's, that's it. it. It's Man, one co cool cohesive itself. unit, and you plug it in in the back. The power wart in the back, right there. Dude, that's it. That is so space conscious. In con it, you, you compare it to the old school shits, it's like fucking big ass. One of my favorite things about it is the old ones. You always had to get that little port lined up exactly to plug mm -hmm. your controller in, whereas this just sits on the contacts. Yeah, yeah. So it just pops right in there. It's easy to get on the stand, and it's instantly charging. Dude, that looks like that right there. With it and make yeah. Sure you hit it just right. It kind so, of, you know, sits down in the place easily. I just see that being a transport for clone troops, like fucking. Yeah, I can see that them. too. I can see that too. Dropping the clone troopers in. Yeah. Okay, so now I was gonna say, now for you to do a little bit of work here, Chad. Oh, you get the red. I get the black. Oh shit. Let me actually go to the wide screen on this. There we go. So. Yeah. Here we go. We got. I got the black controller. Chad has the red one. Yeah. So just uh, peel the little thing off the top. Yeah, you may just... hate me for how I try not to rip the fucking. Box it's fine, art man. Stuff on it's this. fine. Oh, it's cut mine. Yeah. It's uh. Thankfully, the adhesive's not that terrible. No. Cut, cut right oh <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, I, I kind of aped my way into the uh, <laughs> charge, yeah, like, <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. just go Kong on the shit, yeah. rip it all up. Yeah. So I've got mine ready. Yeah. <laughs> I guess we'll unsheath them together. Unsheath our swords. Spell show. Schling. Yeah. yeah, there's a little, oh. you'd put, yeah. You use your thumb. <laughs> Use your thumb, Chad. Use your thumb. I haven't evolved enough. <laughs> nah. Okay. Yeah. Here we go. And. Oh. Uh, uh, yeah. Presented look in front at that. Here. Yeah, I've got the. Mm. I guess on the wide screen up front. There oh. we go. Oh. There you go. So there you are. Got the uh, black one here and the scarlet red one there. Let's uh, go to the overhead. There we go. So, right there. It looks good. Oh, Soul Storm's getting a physical Sleek. release. Sleek. Mm. I like that. I'm kind of tempted to buy it physically, even though I already have it digitally, just to put, add it to the collection of, like, you know, boxes. And Again, stuff. dude, these feel very smooth. Very, very yeah. smooth. The haptic feedback. I'm curious about this. It's still a touchpad thing, right? For yeah. The mouse. So, like, the, the uh, PS4 one kind of feels, I don't know, like, like more of a touchpad. There we are. That's this one's just kind of <laughs> flat plastic. That's that's beautiful. But I'm sure it's on point. It's just crazy. Oh that yeah, that's yeah. able to to do what the other one does because it feels kind. Of, you know what I'm saying? Like you're actually pushing kind of braille or something so it can track you. Like yeah. This is just feels like the rest of the controller. Mm -hmm. so, it's honestly more accurate of a trackpad than the uh, PS4. Oh, I'm sure it is. Too. It just All like. Right. So, I wonder if that shit is in the rest of the controller. There's a part in Astro's Playroom where you use it to uh, push the ball yeah. that you're rolling in. And you got to roll around obstacles across places with no rails. And mm -hmm. I was like, this is going to suck. And it yeah. actually didn't because it was so accurate. Like, Dude, here we go. That's crazy. And all the stuff. It's like, meanwhile, I was trying to play the fucking Switch version of Mario Galaxy and couldn't get Mario to stop rolling his ball straight the fuck off into the. Dude. <laughs> like a room. <laughs> 
I was just like, how is this supposed to even work? This is so bad. And I'm just uh, putting all the extra boxes and stuff inside of the PlayStation box back here. I have little egg crates. So, yeah, this is the charger, the charging apparatus here. I will set it over to the side. We've created a megalith back here. Yes, we have. A megalith of mega proportions. So, we now move on to the mystery box. This mystery box is something... Balloons! Then, Chad, I, I mean, why do I even bring him? Why do I even have him here? He just spoils everything. I should have been aborted. What? Jesus <laughs> Christ! <laughs> Woo! My dude! What was that Biggie Smalls song? Uh, my mama wished she had the abortion. God. And no, his mother does not. His mother oh, was I know. super kind. He said it for the rap bit. What was it? Don't want to go to heaven with the goody goodies. I'd rather have a black Tim's and a black hoodie, something like that. And he's yeah. talking about just being a savage. Yeah. Full edge Lord Biggie Smalls. Dude, that brown box it is does not in fact, give tell to how fucking on point this box looks like you're about to get no, a Gucci this fucking is, belt button. This is <laughs> yeah. This is the Look official the official Compare the brand boxes. skin. No, Look it doesn't. That. What yeah. The? yeah, yeah, here. Yeah, it this right here with all the shiny I mean, logos and stuff it's on not it. Official because well, no, D brand's official one. D brand like yeah, yeah, they say that it's their it's their official one, but it's not an official Sony one. Yeah. And D brand is literally threatening or telling Sony, "Sue us, please. Go ahead." Yeah. So basically, I've got the dark plates. Damn. I've got the dark plates here. A magnetic. Clo- yep. Yes, yeah. it does. Leave it to D brand, dude. They go all out. I mean, look at that. That is just sexy. And if Batman had a PlayStation 5. Yeah, let's let's go to the wide screen on this one. So yeah, as you can see, pretty damn sexy. It's the Bruce Wayne. Yes, it is. You gotta go ahead and put them on. I mean, we can try. I mean, I I know I know the secret. So, all right, as you can see, we got these here. I'm going to put the little foam pieces back in, mm-hmm. and I guess we're going to. Nope. Set you back here for now. So hold, hold up the one with the disc drive slid on it. Okay. And so it's, basically it's back here. You pull this back here to where the little hold up. that's not the same side as the disc drive one. Oh, okay, so it's back here. Be right here. Yeah. So what we're gonna do, the secret is you pull up on this here and you're gonna slide, slide right back. Yes. There it goes. Direction. Yep. Got it. Just like that. It's madness. It is. Absolute insanity. This is fucking madness. Then <laughs> press it down and... Oh, wrong way. There you get. I feel like I'm watching somebody's child be born. Got it. <laughs> hey, look. This is the Black, Oreo white. console. Exclusive. It can be. No, because now you we're going to dunk you it can in the order, You can order a white one of these. <laughs> this is the matte black sticker that yeah. you put on the gloss finish. Mm-hmm. But yeah, look at that. Look at that. That is just beautiful. I yeah. prefer to keep mine glossy. Okay. Yeah, well, that's some people. Some people are all about the gloss. Me, I don't know. I'll play with it a little while. If I want to go matte black, I got the option. So, I also got one for Nick as well because I didn't want Nick to be left out. So, yeah, this... Uh, <laughs> You guys are so lucky. Mods. Tell me about Mods. it, dude. I am still just out of my fucking mind. Well, here's the this. thing. It's really not that much luck. You can get one right now. You can't get one right now, but if you want one very, very soon, like this is around the time of the month they start to drop in stores, mm. go to getaconsole.com. They'll confirm what day the Target drop is. Get on the Target app on your phone. And Bingo. And it'll be at 7 a.m. Like that. that morning. Shit. Bam. And start refreshing. And as soon as they go live, drop it in your cart, and you can pick <laughs> it up in store. Like, that's what I did, and it worked. I told Nate about it. He did the same thing. It worked. He got mm-hmm. both. Yep. Bingo. Bam. Just like that. You yeah. can't just walk we into a store and get an one all anywhere black because they don't even put them on the shelves. You have to We pick have an all-black PlayStation on our hands now. Here's the old Here's the old plates. Thanks. Yeah. Ah. Here you go. You hold that one, like so. Hold it out like this, yeah, for the side. There you go. Angel wings. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. 
And we also got the little matte black sticker here that we can put on the center lay to cover the gloss if we want to. Nate's going to stand his up. Yes, I am standing mine up, so let's get go. up. Get on up. Get up. This just kind of locks into the back vent right here. There we go. Pop lock, don't drop it. Oh, a thing of beauty. Dude. Look at that. Look at that, mother. That is just gorgeous. That, uh, that is the router that routes beautiful video. Yes, it is. Straight to your it, it is basically a gigantic <laughs> internet router. <laughs> Look at this thing. It routes beautiful video games. But that thing, I'm glad. It, I'm glad the uh, Dude, gla the dark the place. The ventilation on this thing is what oh. has been needed for fucking ever. Well, and also in terms of memory expansion as well, you are going to be able to put an M.2 in here. Oh, I believe shit. up to two terabytes. So. If you can buy a two terabyte M.2, you are actually able to put that in and get more space, wow. and it'll be high speed. Yeah, that's sick. I would like one PS5. Yeah. Well, Oxy, I, I thought you had a PS5, Oxy. Um, and I saw Dr. Samuel Hayden says, buy Ultra Kill and play it, please. It is on my Steam wish list. We shall see if it goes on sale when the summer sale starts tomorrow. So, all right. Let me actually get the D-Brand box, seeing as how... The, I am not going to throw away the original plates. No. Why would I? That, uh, that'd be ignorant. Yeah, that, so that, that what I'm going good. to do is I'm going to repackage these like so. I'm going to put the flat pan or the uh, small panel in there. And if you'll put the disc panel in, sir, I will then. No, 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 no. It's it's like that. And then you just uh, push it down like so. All right. Actually, maybe it is like backwards. Okay. I think so. Yeah, that's it. Close enough. If it can close, I'm happy. Cool. There we go. So, I've got these, and I'm going to be saving them for later. <laughs> the router and the mini fridge. Yes, basically. That's, funny. that's you what want to that. Keep this here. Uh, well, actually, yeah, let's uh, set it off to the side. Uh, Honestly, if you set it on the side, it doesn't look quite as much like a router. Yeah. No. It no, that right there looks, looks like, a, like, like a like a console, <laughs> like a clam or a cashew or something. like that. <laughs> Oh, gosh. So, all right, let me set this back here. Now, now we move on to the one that Chad is really excited for. If you want to, go the, ahead. The uh, Bill, Bill Gates special. I will say, once again, the controller, there's no comparison, mm -hmm. period. And that's been that way for quite a while, in my opinion. Unfortunately. But, um, so, I am really excited. So, basically, they have these little tabs these. you can actually pull. Like, oh, okay. You pull those off, and then you're able to open the box. Oh, don't worry. It doesn't tear. The adhesive's pretty friendly. Okay. We'll just do that much to get it open. How about that? Okay. Is that the only one? Uh, no, there's another one over here. Oh, okay. So this drops down, or how's this going to come open here? You guys want to see what I'm doing? Yeah, there you go. That little sticker ASMR. Yeah, this is pretty strong, man. Yeah, it's strong, but it doesn't tear the, the mm. art off. That's the beautiful thing. Yes, that is a beautiful thing. All right, so am I flipping this bad boy mm -hmm. over? Flip it over on that side, and I think we, uh, let's see, I think there's a way to, little fins come out. Ah, I think, uh, where's on the front here? Oh, it's on the front. It's on the, this side, sorry. I think you, uh. I can't open. Oh, this. there it is. So you got to do those two as well. There's oh, four no. stickers you got to pull. Wait until two years until a console's life cycle to buy it. That's when they work out the bugs. Honestly, that's not really true. Mm. Um, with Xbox 360, they never worked out the bugs. They died <laughs> until the end of their fucking lifespan. And I will disagree with, with you on that. With the, the first, with the first. You can disagree revamp. all you want, but I knew like, everyone I knew that had an Xbox 360, even the original three, white ones. Yes, even the fun. No, not the original white ones. The elites too. Mine was an elite. And it fucking ripped. No, me. not the elite. Ooh, everyone the, I knew that had a 360, okay. no matter what we, iteration uh, it was, it ran down like this. Um, and then Nate's the only person I know with a still working 360. You are the exception. So I've you got to the exception. I've got a exception. I've got a while. I know more people who've had fucked up PlayStation 3s than they have Ooh, Xbox. I, I'm me and Andrew are the only two people that I've known. Good that have God, up dude! Holy shit! It's a chunk, ain't it? It is a brick. I worked man. in a game store too, so I'll tell you for <laughs> so a fact that we got a, a uh, also a free thing down here of. Oh wait, no, it's not this one. 
this is the uh, little information tab uh, there. So the Oxy even says every 360 I've ever touched or been around Red Ring, you are a rare consumer, mate. <laughs> yeah, I have Jesus. I have a white one, an arcade that sounds like a fucking. I worked jet at a game engine. store, way more 360s came in than PS3s. Yeah. PS3s rarely ever came in defective. 360s like every day. Yeah, no, well, I, the, no, they old... actually listed off the official failure rates, and that the original Xbox 360s. Yeah, a shit ton of them failed. I think they said over 60% of them oh, failed. Man. Look how Whereas PlayStation was about 35%, which... Dude. Yeah. What the fuck? This looks like a old school radio or something. Mm-hmm. <laughs> there you go. It looks more like a space heater. Than yeah, that. I will give the big dick factor to the PS5 on this one, man. Yeah. Oh, in terms of size, absolutely. It will list the look of it. But that's great, dude. That is so small. Yeah. Also, there's a little I didn't have small that. That. There's a little optical illusion that the Xbox plays with you because when you look at it from this angle here, yeah. it looks like a solid sphere is up here. Yes. But when you look, it's actually a perforated green oh, fan. Whoa. Yeah. It's actually a really cool optical illusion. You stand back like this far. Yeah. If you tilt it, like it looks like a ball inside there. Yeah. But that's when you crazy. yeah, let me show the people. So when you have it like this, oh, see. with the green, I see yeah, what looks like a ball in there. But then you look, it's actually full perforated fan. So that's actually a little cool thing that Austin Evans pointed out. Yeah, and also we have uh, stuff in here. This uh, little flip up. If you want to okay. go ahead and dig into that. Yeah, let's see what's more HDMI action. That's the 2.1. So that's a good thing. It's power. Yeah. I'm glad that both consoles have like the internal power brick, so you don't have like that external one. Just hanging out there all oh, the time. You know what this is. Oh, yeah. The this is... Das Controller. Gonna be interesting. With batteries included. <laughs> well, of course. Uh, yep, the batteries are right there. Really? Who makes the batteries? Xbox still can't seem to move past... Like, that's one, that's one of my biggest things oh, about... but them. you want to know why? Look at the lay branding on that. Well, I know Duracell. Duracell has a deal with Microsoft. They help with their uh, development. That's why... So, is Still, like Duracell is a battery company. Couldn't they make fucking battery packs? They could, but they make more money off of disposables than they do off of lithium ions. Yeah, so essentially you're being ripped off as a consumer by the controller. The, the triggers feel good. Yeah, triggers feel good. The, uh, the D pad, trash. Complete trash. Honestly, there's no excuse for it to still be like this. No. This is really bad. It's an improvement. But yeah, I VR feel like are really fun, for me, for me, even this Xbox, button, this button sucks. For me, Xbox controllers peaked with the 360 controller. They've and gone backwards though. They have. I, I don't think. I mean, I like the grip. Like it feels like it's got grip tape or good something. Good perforated grip. Yeah. But I mean, or there's, good, uh, there's no grip, comparison grip. there. That doesn't feel good at all. No, there's no comparison. Yeah. There. Yeah. yeah. With all due respect to Microsoft, I mean, this just does not feel like a fun controller. Like, here's side by side. Let's get both controllers here. Yeah. You can see they're both very similar in size. As a matter of fact, very similar in shape. Although, the fact that the handles right here go down a bit further enables your hands to fully grip it better. Yeah. And also, the triggers are literally right here, whereas on the Xbox, you have to reach down. Yes. That's the problem. In my natural hand grip, I have to go down. Or, you know, I can use my middle fingers like that, but it... Honestly, no matter how I do it on here, how I, however I have my grip, it's I just feel nat Let's It just feels more natural with this. Let's compare the controllers to see if that has to do with how people like controllers. Because I don't know, it's like everybody has a preference. When I have a natural controller, like when I sit at my hand, it's gonna sit like this, and yeah. I'm gonna place my thumbs on the analog sticks, right? Yeah. That's my default controller position. Anything else I press on a controller. I go up to it from the analog stick. Usually yeah. my default position is the analog sticks. This is why I fucking hate Xbox controllers. I place it like that. Oh god damn it! Well, it's because fucking it feels fucking awful. Well, to it's, have your thumbs like yeah. that. It doesn't feel. Well, right. here's it the makes thing. You feel goofy as shit. No, no, because like, uh, we or Nintendo Switch, the Pro Controller, it's like that. Not to mention, like I hate the way it's shaped, like a fucking like Space Invader. Yeah. Like it, there's no like contour. But right also, here that's and, where like, these so these came into play with the PS1. It's just fucking going to be like right? rubbing against that. So like, you you were playing this this way when you first started playing with the sticks like that. Like yeah, it basically. came it came out on the PS1 that way. Yeah, well, and so to retrain your shit, ones, yeah. like yeah. it'll be awkward. Because even to me, I never agree weird. with anybody that says the 
the <clears throat> Xbox controllers feel better to them. No, even like, to me, well, that's weird. Well, well, for me, the 360 yeah, yeah. controller, still, the 360 controller to me is where Xbox peaked with their design like, it, it because was, where it was smaller it was and least your hands could reach everything. Yeah, yeah, and and also for yeah. me, I don't know, I like this, like I feel I feel like both of them. Good. They're like both are really really good. I, this is crazy as fuck, and I know they have some kind of vortex thing here to make it cool, mm-hmm. but I mean. I'm interested to see here six months, twelve months, how the overheating situation goes in comparison. So I've read both st- both sides of both arguments. Okay, the PlayStation Five does have more heating problems than Xbox. Really? Yes. Well, the I main know they reason had for that kind of, that was well, a focus. To this. The main reason for that is because of their placement of their board inside of this thing. Oh. Their placement is actually, I believe, up high and towards the front when it should be down and towards the middle. Now, Xbox, where it has everything concentrated under one gigantic, like, fan... But if that one fucks up... It pulls. But that's the thing. If this fucks up, this fan is actually a lot easier to replace than the fans in this thing. You actually can pull this thing apart pretty easily. The shroud comes off, and the fan is right at the top. Oh, okay. And you can pull the fan out and replace it. With either an official one from Microsoft or yeah. with a custom one, which I think Austin Evans did a custom one. Uh, he found a custom one that fit, and he found that the cooling on it, even though it was cranked all the way up, was just about the same as the regular one from Microsoft. Hmm. Microsoft actually did a really good job with getting the cooling solution on this handled pretty easily. So I just can't get over how tight of a package this is. It's just like a fucking. I, I expected. You know, even the like you said, when I saw the box, I was like, man, what? Yeah. And this so, is way small. So let me actually get the... Here, we'll do this. We'll do a little uh, console. I hate the fucking controller. No, I know. That's, Why? That's the <laughs> Why biggest... Why does it have to be that way? That's the biggest yeah, issue. Nice if it lets you like, just stick a 360 controller to it to play with. Since they're exactly or the same any controller. I mean, yeah. Jesus, man. Like, what, if, what, what difference does it make? Here we go. So we'll use the black controller over here for this one because, you know, I want to be more a little more showy. And, uh, yeah. It's a mini fridge. What do you expect? So <laughs> it really there we are. Like a so four can fridge. We have the PlayStation 5 with custom dark plates on it. And then you have I'm the... I'm biased, so this is how I would set it up. <laughs> yeah, just load everything. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Play all these games out there to the right in that empty space. Here, here, here. Yeah, yeah. Let's... Let's uh, do a little lean there. Let's uh, go ahead and get this one, this one, and this one. I've, you've already got this one over there, so I don't need to. So there we go. Because, uh, I mean, like, what are you going to play on the Xbox? Well, retro games, because, Chad, that's one big thing you yeah, always Yeah, that's a value. big selling point for me, but emulation has come along so far that it's like... Well, the Anything fact that you can the get Xbox your Xbox 360 to the Xbox, you can play on a PC. Well, the big thing is, but you having the disc, which, oh. you know, uh, it, being able to it, slide it in. and it, Is it possible to play, like, 360 and Xbox discs on this thing? Yes, you can put it like in. Like, already, it will, right now, will, I don't have to wait for fucking a year before no. it's all there? I'm pretty sure that's no, cause they, That's what all the Xbox fans they, are talking about, the big selling point. Oh, yeah. yeah like, you're well, for me, that's really neat. Yeah, and battle. here's why. There's uh, original Xbox games that work with it, too, like, apparently. Yeah, there's yes. over 100 that work with uh, original Xbox games on that. Having to deal Straight with disk game. drive failures on the original Xbox, which are prevalent. Even when yeah. you're... <laughs> when, even, now, it happens in the, play, in the PlayStations, too. I mean... A lot of old consoles have a lot of problems right now. Yes. But, like, being able to just take retro discs and put them in a new machine and it actually work and not have to fucking worry about it, that's great. But you have to take into consideration that original Xbox games are very close to getting to that age where playing the disc is a risk. It is. Because you may get it out of the machine it and it's cracked. But and one it's beautiful thing about it is if you insert it in there... It will copy the game to your di- to your system, yeah. and you can play it forever. Well, or you can, or if because that's their only way you can prove that you have ownership of it. And when right. you do that, it copies the game to it, and you don't have to risk the disc anymore. Well, I for whatever reason, it's not like that on the Xbox One. You well, know, I'll, for whatever reason, you have to put the disc in every time, regardless of even if it's like Morrowind, and you know, 
You, you have to put it in there. Yeah. yeah. To answer a chat question, since Horizon Zero Dawn came to PC, I'm not immediately sold on getting Forbidden West for the PlayStation 5 because I can't fucking aim with a controller to save my life. And Zero Dawn requires some really twitch aiming if you want to be good at it. So I, I do a lot better with the mouse and keyboard. So I'm going to wait and see if they might put it on PC eventually. Oh. If we get like you know three years into its life and it's still not coming to PC, I might pick it up and try it. Uh, yeah. Matthew Deliva, I see your comment there. I remember the Xbox 360. If you tilt it with the disc in it, it'll scratch it. Oh, yeah. Only on that's the original like three. That's on the original 360 the and PlayStation 360, 2. Though. But even a PlayStation One. Yeah, PlayStation One, PlayStation uh, the Two. The bad thing about the 360 is you didn't even have to tilt it. It was bad enough that if someone just walked by too close to it while it was on and vibrated the surface it was sitting on, it would fucking <laughs> laser your disc almost in half. Yeah, I've like yeah. we had so many people bring discs in, being like, "Yeah, we got this game yesterday and it doesn't work," and we turn it over and it's because there's a fucking ring chopped into the yeah. disc, and it's like, "Yeah, you moved your Xbox while it was on." And GameStop wasn't really allowed to do anything about that unless you bought the insurance on it. So that's why we sold. Fuck tons and fuck tons of insurance for Xbox 360 games. So yeah. It's like, yeah, for two bucks, if, if it chops your disc in half, we'll give you a new one. Like, I really recommend it for 360. Like, so, or, the PS4 disc drive was a fucking nightmare, too, for the launch console. That yeah. Yeah, the, see, the PS4 launch run is what I got, and mm -hmm. that disc drive would spit my discs out in the middle of playing games. Yeah, all mine the time, still and does that was it. annoying and shit. Yeah. I, I think it's about to just not even. Well, the, thankfully they got that worked out with the second generation with the Slim and the Pro. Yeah, they they finally got that situation worked out. Again, every time they I'm do... I'm a broke motherfucker. I've got to get the first one. <laughs> but no, it... Oh, it uh, it, that. it put the spitting. screw in the bottom of the PS5 stand, there is no screw. They actually took that out. Yep, they did. What? Yeah, that was the thing they were like advertising that you were going to have to do whenever you first, uh, whenever they first announced how it was going to be on the stand. Mm -hmm. They changed up the stand design when people were bi were bitching about the screws, and so now you don't have to have a screw. They said, "No, screw you. You don't screw us. We screw you." Yeah. So there you go. So, Chad, I mean. What do you think about both of these? Pretty They're cool, fun, huh? Yeah, they look great. <laughs> I, I feel like these are two of the best looking out of the gate consoles. Mm -hmm. I agree. I, I think that they um, definitely went ways that I never thought that they were going to look like, which is just seems to be par for the course. Yeah. But this looks a lot to me like a futuristic version of the launch PS3. Yeah, kind this of. Looks it doesn't look similar to anything Xbox has ever done. It, for me, it, t they're taking sort of an There's Apple utilitarian. Uh, yeah, well, it is they're, a taking, box. they're taking an Apple an utilitarian approach. Is there actually an X on it somewhere? Yeah, there's <laughs> right here on the yeah. where the little okay. button is. Yeah. It's a box with an X on it. I mean, there you go. So it fits the idea. Yeah. yeah so <laughs> overall, I like them both. I, I think it's going to take several months of me. Getting well, to see what's going on with it before I can be like, damn, I'm going to buy one of these. Well, tell you what, Chad. This one's yours. No, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> it's yours, man. No. Yes. No, no, I no, got no, it for no, your no, birthday. No. But it took you three damn weeks to come up here no, and open no, it with. No, yes. No, 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 no. Dude, <laughs> no, I bought Nick a new no, PC. No. Dude, I bought Nick a new PC, man. Yeah, this is yours. This PC is yours. My birthday. Yeah. It's just an Xbox. This is yours, man. Dude, come on. I Are told you. serious? I told you you're my boy. I got your back on he's this shit. He's been telling me for like weeks. He's like, I want him to open it because I'm going to give it to him. And he won't what come the fuck? <laughs> Can somebody? All right. <laughs> <laughs> Where, I, we got to call your mom. We got to get you put in a mental hospital. No. Hey, hey, hey. No, 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 no. What's he on, no, dude? No, no, no. No, no. I don't want to go back. I don't want to go back. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, dude? That's crazy. Hey, man, I told I you to you, take brother. care. Thank you. Hey, man. See you. Yeah, happy late birthday. Do y'all see this? This shit's fucking ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> Hey man, I told I, I told I told uh, Nick a long time ago. I was just like, I got both of these, and I was thinking, of, and I was I was really wanting one of these, and I was also wanting one of these. But then I thought to myself, yeah, Chad's birthday. I got Nick a whole PC. Uh, well, pretty much like upgraded the full thing so uh, internally. On the hard drive, basically. Yeah, basically. <laughs> so and I was just like, you know what? I got this for him. I got this for Chad, and. uh... 
There we go. Oh, and then I well, call you in section five like the next day, and he comes home with a copy of Spider Man. He's like, "Here you go, man." And I'm just like, <laughs> I'm assuming this is his copy of Spider Man since he's planning to go to PS Five. He's like, "No, just use the code. Just keep it. Like, all right." Wow. Yeah. So I've been waiting, dude. I've been waiting to do this for what God knows fuck, how long. Dude? And then all of a sudden, it was just like it just like kept getting delayed and delayed and delayed. And I was just like, "It's gonna be my birthday before we actually get a chance to open these." And lo and behold, here we are, the day after my birthday. We finally opened your birthday present. Well, dude, that's so fucking crazy. if you ever crazy. hear Nate say something like, I never do anything for anybody, point at him and be like, no! <laughs> well, I mean, <laughs> we could sit here side by side and, uh, and sing the herald tale of Nate and his good deeds to others, you know? It's like fucking nah. unbelievable. Yeah, no, it is. But it, this is the kind of shit that goes and proves, you know, if you guys fall down the rabbit hole of bullshit and hear people talking shit on Nate's name about how he took advantage of anybody or did anything like that. Like, number one, I don't deserve this because I'm not doing anything other than just hanging out with one of my fucking homies. He did not have to fucking do this at all, but just fucking wanted to. You know, it, it's, it's overwhelming, and it, it also just brings up how irritating it is when people try to talk shit on the man's name when it should be completely obvious that's not true like holy shit dude what the fuck man i, yeah, I had man. no idea kept the fucking secret i've been over here too i've been over here yeah you've been over here a bunch <laughs> just had time to open these yeah. exactly it's we we're always like after recording all of a sudden it's just like oh dude i gotta go i mean we got band practice yeah or, like, i gotta go because i got because here's the thing he still works a full-time job, and yeah. he still has a lot of stuff going on in his personal life. And I'm not going to interfere with that. I don't want to interfere with that. But I was just happy that I was able to finally do this with you, and we were finally able to let you open this, and now it's yours to have and enjoy. Yeah, I don't even know what the fuck to do. I guess play it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I have to do that, but, yeah. dude, I'm beyond <laughs> blessed. Do with consoles. Yeah. Uh, well, yeah, yeah, I can't, yeah. can't thank you enough for that, dude. Holy fuck. <laughs> Nate, shake that thing. For, no, no. <laughs> Who said what? Well, oh, Ariel. No. I, uh, Ariel wants me to shake my behind. Apparently, well, Roxy wants you to shake. No, no. Behind. She <laughs> shake that thing for Ariel. Yeah. yeah I, gosh. Oh wow. I, I can't do that right now. I can't. But uh, tell you what. Tell you what. I will do this. Here you go. There you yeah, go, well, Ariel. Here's a thing. It is shaking. Shaking yeah. it. That's a thing. <laughs> that was summer school so I, uh, ah summer go. school there you go so, I've been there oh yeah summer school is a, a hell of a thing I've, I, I've been only in summer school once in my life dude I once. passed and, and my fucking parents made me go to summer school anyway dicks cause they were like your grades sucked even though you passed <laughs> I was like really what? like huh yeah <laughs> oh <laughs> Uh oh. Should have bent it before opening. But this yeah. ain't a Pokemon card pack, man. Oh, dude. This ain't a Pokemon card pack. I heard card Dr. Pack. Dale told me that uh, he finally got that shiny Charizard that wasn't fucked up. It took him $3,000 worth of packs to get one. <laughs> to get one card. Damn. Damn, $3, homie. $3,000. What no the shit? Fuck. Damn. All right, later, Oxy. All right, take care, Oxy. Yeah. Be safe. So, yeah. There we are, ladies and gentlemen. We have a now black PlayStation sure Five. PS Five stand don't have a screw on the bottom of the stand. Dude, are you the Rock? I are wish. You actually, the Rock. I wish. In, there's in a, a hole disguise. like there could be a screw, but there's no screw in the box. For it. Oh, oh, wait a second. Wait a second. They have a there's hidden something. screw. There's something here. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Hey Nick, you and I, I think we. Uh, Never mind. They hid it. They hid it from us. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> Holy shit! Okay, so well, that that's it. that explains why it's okay. the more you know. You can't do it on the side, but you can do it on the bottom. Well, I see it right the there. The the little thing you uh, just pop you that pop out. out. I gotta wait. I don't want to unplug it while it's in rest mode. So I gotta wait until we finish oh. the stream so I can turn mine off. And remember, you were saying you gotta be careful because it doesn't hold yeah, it on. Yeah, like that's why. I, I guess like, that's so why. There's a screw to hold it on. Okay. God damn. Where in the hell would that go in, though? But no, on the side, I don't think it can. I think it's only available on the oh, bottom. Oh, okay. Where that little plug comes out. Yeah. It's more secure. Where it actually, yeah, like, it latches on to the back on this. I think that's why. Whereas, yeah, I just got... Yeah. Wait. 
Okay. No, the hole's the hole's not there. The, I I don't think I can pop that out unless I. Huh. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. We will see. Yeah, I'm just like in shock right now. If anybody's like, "Oh, Chad's standing there like a fucking <laughs> dildo on legs," it's because I think that's why it covers up the yeah. screw if you rotate it to the side. That Dude. well. You guys, you gotta get this. Sanity, you gotta get man. this box back up for you. X so you can gonna take fucking it home. give it to you. <laughs> Nate gonna give you the X for your birthday. Well, a little late for your birthday, but still, dude, get it to you for your birthday. So, <laughs> I yeah. So, I'm happy with this. I'm extremely happy with this. I got three controllers, so I can play uh, all the games that I want. Covers the screw up when you rotate it to the uh, side position. Ah, uh, because you don't need it. Case. Whereas, I need to check and like pop, see if I can pop that off the bottom, because if I can, then I, I guess I'll just do that, because I'm going to keep mine standing. I, I, like, I like mine standing. That's just Dude, how I am. I feel like some lights on it would look cool, too. Well, they actually have the little cover things that can go on the... Yeah. That can go and make it like red or yellow Which or Which I don't know green. what the light situation looks like when they're completely up and running. It's right here. Right there. Uh, that's that the rest it? mode. Yeah. And then whenever it's on, it turns blue. Yeah, okay. it, turns, uh, it actually is white when it's running. Uh, yeah. And it's uh, uh, blue whenever it's like uh, reading something. So what you can do is you can actually get the little uh, strip thing, put it on there, and whenever it runs white, it'll display like red or green or whatever. And I, I'm debating getting that because I loved the look of the Miles Morales edition of the PlayStation mm, 5, yeah. but it was gone before anyone had a chance to I'll even bet. get it. Fucking scalpers! Go fuck yourselves. <laughs> Dude, Target has seemed to got a little bit of a hold on that situation with cards Thankfully. and with everything. They had everything fully stocked the last couple times I've been in through there. And they even had like stuff that you would be like, damn, I know scalpers want this. Yeah. You know, yeah. I saw on their uh, Pokemon shelf while I was in there yesterday that um, they have a sign up that's like, uh, just two products per person. Yep. Pokemon, please. Yep. Please, so, thank being, God. being super nice about it, please. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, so blown away. Thank you so much, man. This is going to be epic as fuck. Do they have any colors other than black fuck. for the, black, the back plates right now? The plates, I think they do, but this is the most popular one. Timothy says he likes green and wonders if they had side plates for green. Maybe. I mean, if you want to... If they don't right now, yeah. I'm sure eventually they'll probably decide the custom do other colors. Oh yeah, no doubt about it. And I'm sure they'll have all kinds of crazy shit. Like my PS2 Slim has the Tony Montana Scarface. Yeah, yeah, I remember that. <laughs> sticker on it. Like eventually there'll be all kinds of crazy shit. Yeah, definitely. Unless, you know, like you all said, the, the console companies are starting to come after people making stuff. Even the little stuff. So, which is ridiculous because who knows? On, these well, it's nice this, to have an option that's not going to cost you, you know, uh, three times the price good. that it should. Yeah. At least yeah. those aftermarket. Plus, it's like if it's not available right now, then the company should literally have to shut up about it. You know? Yeah. If they make it available later, then maybe fine. Like, yeah, be like, yeah, we would prefer people cease to do third party versions. Right. Yeah, I can understand that point then, but why? But before it's they even have it available. Yeah. Yeah. Well, they're not in competition it, for it. Not gonna. Is that going to fit like that? Yeah. It'll this fit. is like a Yule Time log. Square log, but square. Yeah. Like the ones you put in the fireplace, the fake ones? Yeah. Yeah, like those. I remember those. Those are. Yeah, that's how they're doing it everywhere, JD. Like, if you want one of these systems, you have to get online when they drop them at the store and do an in store pickup order. They don't reach the shelves. That's why you can't walk in a store and buy one. Buy oh, so if you dude. want one of these, get on getaconsole.com <laughs> and find out what dates they're doing drops hey, and get man. you one online. I mean, you'll and then, get them for this price that way from the store. Of course, I got this as well, so. Same I'm happy as hell. Dude, we're, we're thick as thieves here. and happy as hell right now. This mm -hmm. shit's crazy. Oh, yeah. Th speaking of thick. Yeah. Yeah, I was with I the, the, the guy in the comment section ready to wait this out, but I will <laughs> give my data soon to you guys and okay. you'll, you'll know, you know. Yeah, let yeah get us, I'll get, tell keep you us the truth, up to date you know, on that. Is, it, is that a legit black disc... Uh, this PS5. I thought the digital <laughs> ones were only black. No, this one. Uh, they, the these are, are black. these are custom dark plates from D Brand. 
that they have a limited stock of them every month, and I just so happened to get the ones that came out in June, and I got one set for me and one set for Nick, and the original plates are, oh, wrong side, there we go. The original plates are in here, as you can see. So, <laughs> I, took the, I took these off, and I put the ones that D-Brand sent, and it looks really good. I mean, I'm not complaining in the slightest. And also, they send you these nifty little stickers, uh, one to go on the bottom panel and one to go on the front and uh, top. So, if you want to have this thing be completely matte black, you can do that. But, I'm going to try out the gloss for a little bit, see how I feel about it. Yeah, it looks like oh, yeah. super sharp. Oh, yeah. But honestly, I could see myself if I had the option flipping it back and forth every couple months. Oh, yeah. Because, I mean, hell, uh, you can actually order the other ones from D-Brand. You can get a white middle, mm -hmm. a, a yellow middle. I think they have one that's got like a like biohazard and oh, like the various stick uh, actually like the various things that they have on the uh, little printouts here like they got nuclear skull and crossbones biohazard and the uh, little robot head yeah they got all those uh, that's actually how they avoided copy or how they avoided trademark infringement because they actually did that on the inside of this instead of the uh, X mm -hmm. uh, triangle square and uh, circle. Uh, so yeah, again, everyone, wow. I am ecstatic that Makes you like this. Yeah. I'm glad that you like it, and uh, well, I guess we're gonna have to uh, hear or wait to hear back from you. See what you think about that thing. I will tell you the first game, mm -hmm. Skate Three. Ah, you already know. Oh yeah, absolutely. So <laughs> I guess until next time, everyone. Signing off. I'm Nate. I'm Chad. And uh, this is Nick over here. He's kind of a silent partner. And we'll see you all in the next one, everybody. Peace out.